The Meadow Event Park in Doswell, Virginia was the new home to the 8th Annual Gap and Go Lineman's Rodeo, sponsored by the Association of Virginia, Maryland, and Delaware Electric Cooperatives. On a sun-drenched day, apprentice and journeyman linemen from co-ops, municipal systems, and investor-owned utilities plied their skills in front of a crowd of about 500 people. The competition attracted linemen from as far away as Nevada and included a variety of challenges designed to simulate real-world conditions with a strong emphasis on safety. One of the trickiest events was the Hurtman Rescue, where a dummy simulating an injured co-worker dangled atop a utility pole. Competitors had to don their gear, climb up the pole, and extricate the hurt man in a safe and efficient manner. Apprentice linemen also were tested on a difficult obstacle pole, which required them to climb step by step, only to be confronted with yet another problem. Look at this crazy quilt of wire. One of the apprentice linemen's challenges was to put them together as part of a connection for new service. Apprentices also competed in a CPR event and filled out a written test as part of the rodeo. Three-member journeyman teams from several states toiled in events such as replacing a faulty secondary cable on an energized line and changing a double-dead insulator. Communication was the key here, as two linemen on the pole and the man on the ground barked out step-by-step -step instructions at every stage of their work. And another event required swapping out a broken cross arm. This begged for some serious endurance as the average team spent about 18 minutes making repairs. Some of the top finishers said they plan to compete in an international rodeo to be held this fall near Kansas City, Kansas. Proceeds from the event and a large vendor expo benefit the Virginia, Maryland, and Delaware College Scholarship Fund, which helps dozens of students to attend college each year. Jeb Hockman, a spokesman for the statewide association, said the new location just north of Richmond received rave reviews from participants and onlookers. The rodeo had been held at Liberty University in Lynchburg, but more space is available at the new site. Planning will soon be underway for next year's event, and once again, linemen will be willing to go up a pole on a day off. For ECT.coop, I'm Steve Johnson.